Hello, I'm Justin Schrock. And I am Maddie Maldonado. And this is The Hawkeye, keeping our eyes on what matters. Hey Justin, I think you're going to like this first story we have. Why's that? Because it involves one of your favorite things, heroes. Really? Yes, but not in the way you think. We all have our favorite comic book heroes. Maybe yours is Superman or the Batman who helps protect Gotham City. But outside of the movies, in the real world, there are everyday heroes as well. No, they cannot fly, but they each hold a special talent in helping others. Yes, that's true. Everyday people giving back to others makes them a community hero in our eyes. Exactly, and I hear our person leaves a pretty positive impact. Indeed she does. Our reporter Thomas went out and got the chance to speak to our community hero. Let's take a look for another segment of Hawkeye Heroes. Valerie Fry used to be part of an organization called Patriot Paws, which was the inspiration of her breaking off and creating her own organization called Canine Solutions. I was in college and then I started working with a service dog organization at that time and I realized that the dogs really responded to me more than they might some of the other trainers and so I was able to work through some of the behavioral issues that those dogs have. My passion is mainly with the veterans because probably 90 or more percent of our veterans have PTSD. And with a dog, they don't really have to focus or rely so much on being medicated to be able to deal in society anymore. The biggest problem I find is that not enough people really know that they can actually do this on their own. They can train their own service dog and they're not having to wait for years for their service dog or they're not having to spend thousands of dollars to do it either. I'm able to go out in the public settings, which before I met them, I rarely ever went out of my house and dealt with very little people. My confidence level has been lifted since working with them, which I didn't try, I couldn't before. It literally helps keep me alive. For more information on how you can help with Canine Solutions, go to www.caninesolutionsdallas.com. Let's further this topic of helping others and talk about Rockwell Heath High School's BPA Club giving back to their community. For those of you who do not know, BPA, also known as Business Professionals of America, is a national organization that allows students to better their future careers in competitive events. So, Maddie, I heard you got the chance to talk to these kids and see what they did firsthand. Indeed I did. I got the privilege to tag along with the students as they gave back to others. For their community service project, the BPA club members spent their time spreading holiday cheer to the boys and girls of their community by helping out the man himself, Santa Claus. Let's take a look at that eventful day. The heat is starting to die down. The houses are being taken over by bright lights and the boys and girls are being extra good in preparation for St. Nick which could only mean one thing. It's Christmas time here in the city of Heath, and that means not only is it time to receive, but it is also the perfect time to give back as well. And Rockwell Heath's BPA club members are giving back here today to all the children in the area. The students and I will get the opportunity to help out a very busy Santa as we spread holiday cheer by helping him with his letters to all the children. We're helping Santa out by addressing his letters and also putting stamps on them so we can get them sent out as soon as possible. The reason why I'm doing this is because I love the thought of helping others and I thought letters to Santa would be a perfect opportunity. This is the perfect time to spread holiday cheer and I believe doing the Santa letters helps out a lot with that because my community can use a little pep in their step every now and then. Well, today put me in the holiday spirit. How about y'all? Yeah! yeah. It's truly inspiring what y'all are doing. Thanks for letting me tag along. Because after all, tis the season for giving back. That looked like a fun day. I can only imagine the faces of kids when they open their letters. It was such a treat to be a part of the whole process. Yes, and seeing those antlers was a treat itself. <laughs> well, that's all we have for today. I'm Maddie Maldonado. And I'm Justin Schrock. Until next time. We'll be keeping our eyes on what matters here at the Hawkeye. Bye, everyone.